Example 3. We have a composite function h of x, which is equal to 1 plus sine of square root of 1 plus x squared to the third power. Let's find its derivative using chain rule. And to begin with, we should figure out the order in which the functions imposed into this h of x function are to be applied. And there's a simple idea for that. We should imagine that we want to estimate this given function at a certain point using calculator. So we'll start with this polynomial we have under the square root, 1 plus x squared. And we'll calculate it using calculator. So our f sub 1 of x function is 1 plus x squared. Then having obtained this result, We'll use calculator one more time and we'll find square root of this value. So our f sub 2 function will be square root of f sub 1. Then our f sub 3 function will be this sine over here. So we'll take the calculator and find sine of this value we obtained in this previous step. So f sub 3 is equal to sine of f sub 2. Then we'll take this value and add 1 to it. And that would be our f sub 4 function. So we have f sub 3 plus 1. And then finally, we'll raise the result to the third power using calculator. So f sub 5 function will be equal to f sub 4 to the third. So the given h of x function is a composition of five functions. Let's recall the chain rule for the case of composition of, of five functions. In general, it goes like this. We have h of x function, which is given in the form of f sub 5, of f sub 4, of f sub 3, of f sub 2, of f sub 1, of x. And its derivative is found as follows, h prime of x equals f sub 5 prime of f sub 4 of f sub 3 of f sub 2 of f sub 1 of x multiplied by f sub 4 prime of f sub 3 of f sub 2 of f sub 1 of x multiplied by f sub 3 prime of f sub 2 of f sub 1 of x and then multiplied by f sub 2 prime of f sub 1 of x and then finally multiplied by f sub 1 prime of x. So basically we need to find these five derivatives. So let's do that. equals cosine of f sub 2 which is co 
cosine of square root of 1 plus x squared. Then f sub 4 prime of f sub 3 gives us simply 1. And f sub 5 prime of f sub 4 is 3 times f sub 4 squared, which is 3 times 1 plus sine of square root of 1 plus x squared to the second. Let me just move these derivatives to the left so that I get some space on my right. five derivatives. So we have 2x times 1 over 2 square root of 1 plus x squared times cosine of square root of 1 plus x squared times 1 and times 3 times 1 plus sine of square root of 1 plus x squared to the second which is equal to 3x times cosine of square root of 1 plus x squared times 1 plus sine of square root of 1 plus x squared to the second over square root of 1 plus x squared. Right. And that's the answer. <laughs> 